In 1895, the village of Cudahy was organized with a population of 854. In 1906, the population had increased to 2,556, and the area was incorporated as a city. The city now has a population of an estimated 15,600, and covers an area of approximately 5 square miles. Among the city's newest buildings is the municipal building located on the eastern outskirts of Cudahy. Another recent municipal project is the new water utility project, put into operation in 1954. Vincent Totka is the mayor of this thriving city. He's served consecutive terms since 1940. The city council is made up of two aldermen from each of the five wards. At this meeting, the mayor is conferring with Alderman Kovac, Gregory, Hopp, and Director of Public Works, James Thierry. The term of office for each elected official is two years. The health department, with a staff of five, also has its office in the municipal building, along with the police department. Chief Anthony Wise is the fourth police chief in the city's history. He has a department of 21 men. The department has three squad cars and a detective car at its disposal, along with other modern police equipment. The fire department, with its station downtown, consists of 19 volunteers, 10 full-time firefighters, and Chief Sigmund Bukowski. A police and fire commission selects the chief, the officers, and all other members of the department. The fire department is also part of a county-wide program, whereby it will assist other communities during major fires. A recent addition to the city is the Memorial Library. Dedicated in 1952, it stands as a tribute to the men of Cudahy who served their country during World War II. The library is located in a convenient downtown area across from the new post office building which opened in 1954. The new post office is just a few blocks from the site where the city's first business establishment opened in 1893. A new YMCA building was dedicated in 1955. The modern building was built at a cost of nearly $200,000 and houses a rifle range and archery ranges in addition to meeting rooms, lounge, and other facilities. The modern buildings are the latest improvements in a city which began when the Cudahy Meatpacking Plant was built on the original 700 acres of land, which became the nucleus of the community. About 15 years after Cudahy moved to the area, a man named George Meyer began building automatic bottle washing equipment in Milwaukee. In 1938, he too found Cudahy a good place to set up his rapidly expanding operations. Another familiar industry established here the same year is the Milwaukee Crane and Service Company. The city's largest industrial plant is the Laddish Company. Its plant stretches for almost one mile through the city and employs about 6,500 people. Cunahay High School was built in 1926 and now has an enrollment of 680 students and a faculty of 31. There are four parochial grade schools in the city three Catholic and one Lutheran. There are also five elementary schools in the public school system. The oldest is Washington School, established in 1895. St. John's is one of three Lutheran churches in the city, and the Holy Family Church is one of three Catholic churches. Cudahy Methodist Church completes the list of the seven churches in the city. Most of the churches have already been built or are planning to build new facilities. The new St. Mark's Evangelical Lutheran Church is one such project. Another construction project underway is the Trinity Memorial Hospital. Located in the southern part of the city, the hospital will serve the communities of Cudahy, South Milwaukee, Oak Creek, St. Francis, and Town of Lake. Not far away, a new school is being constructed to replace the present Lake School and another school will be built in the Holy Family Parish in the near future. Sheridan Park is a popular recreation area for Cudahy citizens. The 69-acre site was turned over to the Milwaukee County Park Commission in 1928. A historic note concerning the park reveals that it served as a site for a wireless station at one time, the first wireless station in the state 